Hello, I'd like to make a short but crucial point about Popper's most famous book, The Logic of Scientific Discovery. Basically, Popper argued that there is no logic to scientific discovery, there is no procedure guaranteeing creativity, no recipe for creativity. Uh, part of the confusion lies in the uh, title of this book, which in English is Logic of Scientific Discovery. However, in German it's Logik der Forschung, uh, which indicates more logical procedures to do with research rather than a logic of discovery. Uh, if we turn to page 8 of this book, we can see that the way Popper understood science and art participating in the same culture and to understand creativity, to understand discovery in one domain, such as the domain of art or music, we also have to understand the way it operates in science and, and vice versa. Uh, so basically at the bottom of page 8, Popper states, there's no such thing as a logical method of having new ideas or a logical reconstruction of this process. My view may be expressed by saying that every discovery contains an irrational element or a creative intuition in Bergson's sense. In a similar way, Einstein speaks of the search for those highly universal laws from which a picture of the world can be obtained by pure deduction. There is no logical path, he says, leading to these laws. They can only be reached by intuition, based upon something like an intellectual love or Einfühlung of the object of experience. Thank you.